I started feeling like I was a failure for never doing them. And that I was being a failure to MRL. And just ended up crying. Gotta love anxiety and major depress major depression. Good morning, world. Good morning, internet friends. Good morning, everybody. Hi, guys. Hi. Hi. Anxiety when sleep is not your friend. We've been adding on to the list all day today. Good morning, internet friends. How are we doing today? These two are doing playtime. Slash, we are too loud for mom. So Merry Christmas Eve! Or by the time you see this, it will be Christmas. So Merry Christmas! And today is also Emeril's two-month birthday. He's two months old. Are you excited, puppy? You know, not really. I'm too busy playing. So, been an interesting morning. A little bit threw up. He had some diarrhea, but it's not Parvo, so that's good. Um. It's also something that Riddler did when he was younger. He had a lot of like loose stools, so it's probably nothing. But yeah, we're going to be going to my mammal's house in Calhoun today for Christmas Eve. It's gonna be fun. Um, I already got some anti-anxiety essential oil on because I already feel like that's gonna happen. I'll try to remember to film some whenever I'm there, but I'll be using my phone. So yeah, just wanted to check in with you guys and tell you good morning and Merry Christmas. Or Happy Hanukkah, Happy Kwanzaa, whenever those are celebrated. I'll check back in with you later. Hey guys. Hey sassy girl. Hey Riddler. I mean Emerel. Oh, I'm tired. Why did I call you Riddler? You're Emerel. Hi Emerel. You're stealing your brother's bone. You have his Chewy, you have your Chewy, and you have ropes. And yet you're wanting to chew on everything else. So, I forgot to film today. Oh well. So it was fun in my mammals. I got to see some aunts and cousins. James came and James is at, our, is at our house now, so yay. We had food, played phase 10, got home, and chaos kind of broke out. Little Bit decided to chew on his bed and rip it. So now he's using Sassy's bed. Um, the toilet downstairs is blocked somehow, so trying to get that figured out. I have a really bad headache, so I was getting annoyed with Riddler and MRL for barking a lot. And I know this is dumb, but I guess when you're just not feeling good, just everything annoys you. And then, of course, I was getting on to MRL for chewing on the bed, chewing on basically everything. And tonight, he's just being a little naughty. Then again, we left him in the house for about half the day because I couldn't bring him with us. I wanted to, but my grandparents said no. And right now, they don't know what his purpose is. Because eventually he will have to come. But I don't even want to deal with that right now. And anxiety did pretty well while I was there. It kind of like came up a few times worrying about like dumb things like social interactions not food for one so yes and okay I thought he was chewing on my lanyards again now I'm just home I think having a headache and not feeling that good has made me kind of irritated because I've been getting a little more grouchy I think I'm also tired I got some caffeine in me so hopefully that will help I'm just super tired. Got a headache. Not feeling very Christmassy, honestly. But, oh well. That's a part of mental illness, too. And a part of life. You don't have to feel happy all the time. You don't have to feel Christmassy all the time. I don't feel very Christmassy right now. But maybe once my headache goes away, I'll feel better. So, yeah. I'm just gonna lay back, chill for a little bit, and I'll check back in with you later. Hey, guys. There's Sassy, who's not appreciating that I brushed her teeth. There's Emeril, who knows that they're going to get brushed whether he likes it or not. You want to say hi? Oh, don't eat them. Don't eat them, silly boy. Here. Whoa. Little bit of rope before bedtime. A little bit of rope before bedtime. So, um, 
I ended up talking with a few people who are also service dog trainers about just how irritated and upset I was feeling. And I felt horrible because they were giving me advice, which is great advice. But I started feeling like I was a failure for never doing them. And that I was being a failure to MRL. And just ended up crying. Gotta love anxiety and major depress major depression. Great. So now I'm feeling worse. My headache is starting to go away, but still feeling pretty down. Not feeling the greatest. Um, and then of course on top of that my brain's like, oh hey, you know what? You're not as sick as some people. There's some people who have it much worse than you. Why do you even have a puppy for a service dog? Because you're not that sick. And just... It's not helping my mood at all. So I tried laying down for a little bit in the dark. A little bit, took a nap with me. Then went downstairs, grabbed something to eat. And then I was getting lectured from mom, which I wasn't too happy about. There goes my phone. Hold on one quick second. All right, got my alarm turned off. Still playing rope with puppy. At least still get him tired before bed. Um, what was I saying? And just not feeling good. I was getting more irritated. And of course, depression is still being eh. But at least I've gotten some meds for my headache. And now I have finished with the bedtime routine, which is putting oils on. This time I also added a drop of Valor to help with the anxiety and depression. Um, I thought about putting in Joy, which is great for depression, but it also can wake you up. So that was my brother come up on the stairs and we were talking. And now I'm kind of forgetting what I was talking about before. I think the um, sleep meds are starting to kick in. Things feel like they're moving a little more slow-mo and my brain is a little more slurred. Um, I mean, I was a lot of, like, feeling like I'm already being a failure for MRL and setting him up for failure. Even though, really, right now, his main thing is to just be a puppy. Learn your basics. Learn potty training and crate training and leash training. Just be a puppy. And rationally, my mind knows that. He's just a puppy. Let him be a puppy. But then the irrational part's like, he's got a very important job in the future, and you want to set him up right. Probably why I shouldn't be a parent to a human child, because with this mindset, I probably would be throwing my child down into the deep depths of anxiety. <sighs> I would screw up my kids. I know it. So, yeah, that's how the night is. So... Ow, that was my toe, that was my toe, that was my toe. Sorry, a little bit decided to bite me. Because he's mean. Yes, get the rope. Not my toe. And we get the other rope. And plop. So, I guess before... Everything is completely drained out of me. I'm going to sign off for the night and head off to bed. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've had a wonderful day or night, rain or shine, whatever the world has for you today. Um, question of the day is... Ow, stop. Ah, drop it. Drop it. Good boy. I can't think of a question of the day right now. My brain's got meds going. And of course, low serotonin and then puppy trying to eat me. So, you get a free night. Congratulations. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye, Bitey McBiterson. Bye, sassy girl.